I want to make a quick video just showing a, a new thing that I've been using at home. I got it recently, about a week ago, um, and it's because I do a lot of my work, a lot of my video making, my planning, or whatever at home. Not, that's not for everyone I know, but um, I don't have the ability to make videos between patients and stuff. Um, and when I'm doing more like development testing stuff, I like to use my laptop at home. Problem with the laptop is limited space. Now, I use a... Um, Microsoft Surface Book 2, it's 13 and a half inch monitor. Now, when I say limited space, I don't mean because the screen size is small. It's still the same, you know, well, essentially the same proportions as a normal computer monitor. It's not that. Um, I used to have a, um, a 55 inch monitor uh, computer, a uh, television, that I would use the monitor on my, on my wall here. So it'd have one, two, three, four different windows. Because that's the problem. It's not one size. It's the proportion, okay? And I'm sorry, that was a 50-inch TV or whatever. The, the, the thing about it, though, is, is that like a lot of offices, a lot of people anymore, are using dual monitors. So that you can have two different softwares at the same time. Because if you run like a planning software, a design software, and you split the middle of the screen, the ratio is not right. It's just not what we are used to. Uh, certain softwares just don't work that well. Like Blue Sky Plan is not really designed to fit in the middle of the screen. Uh, Seric software, uh, most design softwares. Uh, Mesh Mixer, sure, it would work. Uh, it does get a little bit funky. I've done it. But if I want to have something else, uh, so I'm limited, okay? So what I recently bought was was this. It's called a side track, and I'll have a link in the video, in, in the description. With this, right here, which you may or may not have noticed, is that these four little silver kind of mirror looking things. They are adhesively attached. This has four little magnets that lock on. Out of my bag, this is my laptop bag, I've got this little cable and I bought this cable. This device comes with a three foot cable. This is a foot and a half. And it's got, it's a USB-C to USB-C cable. It's got these two little, I, I bought a, a two set of 90 degree angle um, adapters, you'll see why. That allows me to plug in the side here, plug it into the side of my laptop. Of course, if you don't have um, this, you know, a USB-C output on your laptop, it'll go to normal USB as well. So now, when I open up my laptop, let it make sure it recognizes me and opens up. I can slide this out, and I've got a dual monitor. It will pivot and whatnot. So now I can have like photos on one, I can have my planning software on another, I can have a spreadsheet, I can have a web browser, I can do whatever I want. I've got dual monitors, like I might have in my office. Um, I don't presently have two monitors in my office actually, but a lot of people do. And I find this extremely useful, um, especially with portable laptops. So. Um, Anyway, it's nice. I mean, uh, I won't get into it too much, but it allows you to swing it around. So if you have someone behind you that you could be, you could duplicate your screen so they can see what you're working, looking at. Um, you can detach the whole thing, set up like a separate monitor all, all the way to the side. But for me, this is the real purpose. Okay. And again, it just slides together, tucked away, and it's off. Okay. So, I mean, for portability, it's, you know, it's, it almost doubles the thickness of my laptop. So that's not great, but you know, it's fine. Not a big deal. And all I have to do is pop it off. There are competitor screens out there. The reason I went with this one, um, there's one, I got this on Amazon. There's another one. The magnets allow it to slide to move it around a little bit. If you don't like the position, I was worried about that because I don't want it wandering. I want it to stay right where I put it. And this, the way it's set, it doesn't move. Now, I will give you a tip thing I didn't know. I, mean, I, I figured out when it was put together, but I overestimated. What I'm getting at is when they tell you to position this, if you decide to buy one, you peel off. These things are magnetically attached here. You peel off the adhesives. They tell you to just center it and put it on. But what I did was instead, I put up my monitor about how I wanted it. And then I simply slid it up against my monitor, okay? The reason being is that way I knew that if it hit, it would stop. Problem is I was a little bit nervous and so I over tipped my monitor because I didn't want to be too limited or restricted. But now since I've done that, the weight 
does make it want to kind of fall back slowly. Okay, so I would advise really put it exactly where you want it, slide it up so it adheres, and then you're good to go. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. No, nothing too fancy. Um, I'm, I put together a, um, a, a kit.com uh, kit. I've done that before with like PRF stuff, with printing uh, processing uh, tools and stuff. Basically, it has one button, you click on it, and it populates your Amazon cart with everything that I'm recommending. It has the monitor itself. It has the one USB-C, one and a half foot cable. Again, if you don't have USB-C USB to USB-C, it might not be pertinent to you. Um, and then it also has the um, link to these two adapters here. Now, if you don't have USB-C output on your computer, you can still get this cable and then buy this, I guess, you'd only need one of them, but the other one you would just buy at a right angle that was USB-C to USB, okay? You can figure it out. It's not a big deal. Just have to find your right adapters. Um, again, it comes with one, but it's three foot. It's just too much extra cable. I don't want a bunch of extra cables. And this is much more discreet than the one it comes with. Slides right in my laptop bag. And as you may or may not have realized, because as you're just watching the video, all my laptop slides in very nicely into this case. The extra monitor does as well. And I am good to go. In my front pocket, I've got my mouse, I've got my charging, I've got my wireless headphones, I've got my um, my clicker for when I do presentations, I've got my Microsoft Service uh, um, pen, it's got various things. I mean, this is a nice bag, I'm also going to put this on my website just because I've been through a few different bags trying to find one that carries my laptop and gives me extra storage. So that's it. Hope this